the link skin in fortnite we are going to draw this today and i'm going to show you a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to do it well we are not going to take in case of the coloring but before we begin make sure you guys subscribe to the channel because if you guys subscribe to the channel you can help us reach 200,000 subscribers we're so close to it and make sure you guys hit the notification bell once you guys are subscribing to the channel to get all the notifications from the channel make sure you guys like this video because it would really mean a lot uh, and would show us you know your appreciation to this tutorial of our drawing so make sure you smash the like button down there so let's begin today's video and so basically in this video i will be showing you guys an illustration and after when i'm done with the illustration with the marker so that you guys can understand how to draw it okay then i'm going to color and use my pencil to draw this whole structure so we start off with a curve a basic curve and a standing line and a straight line which will be curved at the end this is how we start we always start with the head we can start with the body as well but i really want to start it with the head because it's pretty difficult when we start you know from the body to get everything in place so we start from one point and then we go from there we are drawing the cap right now and the years the bunny years of the link skin in fortnite season 7. so the first thing we are making the structure of the cap first how the cap would really look like so i hope you guys have a pencil with yourself or a marker i would urge you guys that you have a pencil and a razor and a sharpener with you at all times so that just in case if you go wrong at any place you will be able to like you know erase and move a step back the only reason i'm doing it with the marker so that i can illustrate the basic structure the basic mainframe of the drawing and after that you can you know use any of your colors you can start the game and you can use any colors you want now for this one you know i'm going to use a pencil but later on this is the cap the marker but later on, i'm going to use a marker to show you guys the exact position of the cap now i'm going to go ahead and show you with the rest of the illustration of the whole character well if this is too fast for you maybe you can slow down the video if you want or you can pause the video till the time you draw the whole structure once you're done with the structure you can then carry on with the same so now we are doing the hair part so it's it's not in the same curve but it's on the curve which is you know similar to the hair so we make a curve over there to our left side and now what we are going to do i hope you guys have followed me till this far so i will be taking some pauses in the middle so that you would understand so i make a small straight line and then i'm making the structure of the face a big curved line okay that would be the cheeks and the jawline so that would be the face ladies and gentlemen whoever is you know drawing with me side by side i can guarantee that you will be able to make a fully finished links drawing at the end so st stay with me as i take you through this journey while i am like in telling you guys how to draw the link skin so i join these two structures then i make the eyebrow and it will be an exact opposite v like a vertical opposite v now we make another small dot now what we're going to do with well, the reason we made a small dot because we need to make the rest of the hair that line was for the cap and the small are the small perforations on the cap okay i hope you guys have followed me till this far now i'm going to take you through the next step where i will be making the hair so i make a small dot right over there and some straight lines right after the other in 90 degree turns then what we're going to do we're going to join these two things to make the hair i hope you guys have followed me till this far okay so now we make a straight line another straight line to make the glasses so we will like do the same thing extend the straight line to make the frame of the glass that she wears so we are going to make another straight line another straight line and another straight line this is the main frame of the glass so now we're going to the other side and we are going to make the other frame of the glass so i hope you guys are with me if not you can pause the video and go back scroll back at any time and you can re-watch it while you're drawing with me we're going to go to the eyes at the end 
we need a very thin marker for the illustration for the eyes I, I will be making sure from the next drawing onwards I would have a I would have a thin marker to show you the illustration but for this video I will be you know taking my pencil and you know showing you guys like on how to do the nose the lips and the eyes in this video so I hope you guys are with me on this one if you guys have reached till this part of the video we have made the, another figure another drawing of the ice king skin so for that make sure you guys stay subscribed in there is a video on the channel so if you want you can check it out there will be this eye thing which will be coming on the top right side of the screen you can click on it to go to that particular video of the ice skin skin so we had an illustration of that as well so now what we're going to do we are going to like you know do some changes so that we can zoom in and out on how to do the nose structure so now we are going to head over and making the neck so we make a straight line over here and i hope you guys are following me through this after this we make another straight line for the collar and then we make a straight line directly to the center and we are going to do the other side now so that we can have that perspective as you guys saw that I extended that line because I need to make the clothing for the links so that's the reason I extended the same now I'm making the collar like of the dress which will be coming out from the side so just follow me through this video a step-by-step -step tutorial and now we are going to connect these two dots so that it becomes a part of the cloth now we extend it through a straight line and then we make a turn, bend it and make it into a curved line. Then we make another straight line, make it go down, make it into a curve that would be the clothing of the links. I hope you guys are with me on this video. And then we make a straight line and then we curve it at the end. After this, we make a straight line to join the other side of the cloth, which would be her jacket. That she wears on top of her top so now what we're going to do we're going to do the hands so that would be her upper arm and then we make the sleeves with a straight curvy line a straight line and then another curve for the shirt then we make a little bit of an extra thing for the hoodie like for the jacket robes and what we are going to do now is what we're going to do like from the other side we are going to make the other side of the jacket so that you guys will be able to understand from one process to the other one how we are doing it so we make the other side of the jacket we make another twist and turn make it like go down all the way by making a curve and then we extend it from the other side pretty easy and then we make a similar similar line for the jacket for the outer lining so it will be like two curves which might look like a side mountain and then we make like two two lines one after the other just make sure this is not a straight line this is a, a little bit curved line for her jacket okay so now the jacket is very important so make sure you make these two curved lines right now we're going to make the other arm it's simply straight so and you have to make the jacket then you have to like make the other side of the arm pretty simple then we join these two things into a curved line which will be her jacket which what she's wearing on top make the patterns make the stitchings now we are going to do some small dots to make it look like a zipper in this illustration you can use your pencil and you can just go in depth and make the zipper properly now we can either go on with the body that's what we're going to do to give you guys a full perspective of what's happening in this video so now we're going to go to the other side of her body and make the waist and this would be her top and make sure that this is into a curved line make sure the lines are all curvy and now we're going to make the bottom side of her top so for this it's very simple make a big curved line a big u and we're going to do the same on the other side a big U now we're going to do an inverted U to join these two dots how simple is that isn't it so we are like almost halfway through in drawing the link skin we're making the hands so a curved line and almost another little bit curvy line which would be our upper arm and then her lower hand 
Now we're going to do the same. A curve over there and then we make it go down. Now we're going to make our gloves. So we make a straight line. You know, it's two straight lines and another straight line. That would be her glove. And the, we do it the same way from the other side to make her hand. So we're doing it one thing simultaneously so that you guys would understand on what stage we are in the drawing. It's all curves. It's all lines. So you need to follow me through this video as I take you in this journey. Now that's her leg. Now this is a big curved line. Just make sure the curve is adjacent and it's running on the same path of her top. So just make sure you do that. We are going to make another curvy line and make sure we join, not join the two legs. We're not going to go like all the way down and we're going to make half of her body so that we, you would understand it. it becomes really easy for you guys. Now this would be the pattern of her cloth. So we make another curved line to give the curvature of the thighs. Now what we're going to do, we're going to go with the gloves and the hands. It's very easy, so curved straight line, and at the end, it's a curve. It's simple, simple. Straight line and a curve, straight line and a curve. Now we're going to go with the other leg so that you would have an, an understanding of the perspective. So that's our thigh, and we now are going to make the rest of her pants. So another curved line. Make sure it's not straight, it's a little bit curved. It's a little curve, okay, to give it the perspective. So now we're going to make both the hands easy and simple so i start with this side make the glove now this one would be her thumb the, the one we, that we are making right now is the thumb small thumbs okay now we're going to go with the pointer finger we make these two things just follow me through this video you can use your pencil that's a pinky that's the other other finger and that's when the last we're going to go with the other finger that's how easy things are ladies and gentlemen now we're going to go with the other hand and we are going to make the rest we made another thumb from the gloves that she's wearing and now we're going to make a curved line so that we can give the outer edge of the glove and what we are going to do right now is going to make the rest of her fingers we make it into a straight line that will be her finger and now it's a curve now you need to use your colors to give give the effect of the depth of field like how far the hand is if it's curved or not so this is like an illustration on how you can do it ladies and gentlemen you can do it easily if you have missed on any part you can slow down the video on youtube or you can download it somewhere you can watch it again and you can go slowly you don't have to be fast like me you have to just be slow take your time and do these things in a slow process because good things take time okay for the eyes i can't use a bold marker so i am going to use my pencil and i'm going to show you up close how it looks like so that you would have a better idea of how it looks like in a very close proximity so i uh, make sure guys you guys give this video a big like and subscribe to the channel we are very close to 200,000 subscribers and it would really mean a lot to me if you guys can subscribe to the channel so I, i'm going to, right now i'm going to go ahead and use another piece of paper where i'm going to start drawing into uh having a pencil and that's how i'm doing it ladies and gentlemen so i'm not right now i'm going to use a pencil to illustrate how it looks like and then right away we can give it some colors you know in your own way start the game you know and start adding some colors so over here as you guys can see you know like it takes a lot of time to use your pencil i fast forwarded the clip so that you would understand like a step-by-step -step process so this is the whole illustration ladies and gentlemen this is the whole illustration that we have done and after we you are done it whenever you're satisfied with your drawing you, there's always time and you can always improve what you have drawn so yes guys subscribe to the channel check and uh, this is the final product how it would look like after you're done drawing and putting in all those colors i know ladies and gentlemen so i hope you guys have enjoyed this video if you did so check out the other drawing that have done it's appearing on the screen right now it's a, it's a drawing of the ice king the tier 100 skin so feel free to check it out and try to draw the same and i just tweet me out if you have drawn and i will be more than happy to rate your drawing so yes comment section down below tell me what you guys think of the drawing and i'm going to see you guys soon on my next video goodbye and have a great day ahead